I want you to become a monk. Oh, what the crap was that? I think we're taking him uh, all the way up <laughs> the church. So, this is it then? It's only us, Jack. You and me. I'm it not sure us. about that. Only us. Oh my god, freaking Philip. Hey! Philip the Prior! Monk! What? Oh, so... Oh, never mind, the king was captured, and we are captured as well, alongside him. What the crap? Oh my god. Uh, yeah, let's respond to the king, I guess. Let's see what, uh... What's happening here. After the Battle That's of better. Lincoln. Never let them see you weak. I guess. Stand tall. Hmm. Oh, Captain Knight. Oh, I think that's Richard. Richard! Yeah, Don't yeah, yeah. draw attention to yourself. Not when they have you in a cage. Not if you're the king. Why am I in here? You are with us, are you not? I prayed for peace. Peace is the wait between one battle and the next. You were right about William Hamley. How so? The moment the battle took a turn for the worse, he and his men switched sides. The Earl of Shiring is fighting for Maud now, and for Robert. William Hamley is only fighting for himself and for Bishop Waleran. Hmm. Wow, how things turn around in this uh, freaking game. It's crazy. Oh, crap. I thought it was the word of gods. Can we chat with the... Oh, what actually, about no, Ranulf's men? Probably glad to be out of the castle after all that time. Probably looking for women and getting drunk. Hmm. I wanted to talk with this uh, guard here, but apparently we cannot interact with him. Do this with the king? He never was a man of God. Now I think I know why. Crap. Oh, people by the fire, apparently. Let's check that out. How many died? What? How many people died in the battle? Too many. I even lost my horse. But Robert is not an animal. I'll give him that. Or we wouldn't be here. I will hmm. grant you your market rights. The same as Sharing. You will? Why? You were right about William. But you're not king anymore, are you? Before too long, the throne will be mine again. Assume I granted you these rights before the battle was lost. Do I have your word for it? I will let our Empress Maud know about you. Hold your market. Stand your ground. William Hamley will have no legal way of going against you. I will tell the guards there is no reason to hold you any longer. Oh, thank God. What about you? My loyals will make their moves. The game is not yet over. I ordered them to capture Robert to make an exchange. Maud knows it's not over. She'll save her each day that she has me under lock and key. She is her father's daughter, but the throne of England is mine. If you want peace, if you want to save the lives of the innocent, you have to give up. Never. That's the only thing I'm not good at. Then there really is no hope. Guards! Release the monk! <laughs> this really is a freaking Game of Thrones, man. I'm telling you. All right, market license for Kingsbridge. Inspect. After the Battle of Lincoln, Kingsbridge was granted market rights by the English throne. The license grants Kingsbridge the same right as Shiring. Finally, Philip is able to reopen the market, but in addition to that, is also allowed to hold a fleece fair. 
This is a great opportunity for the town and its people as the wool traders, despite the conditions on the place fair in Shiring. The Priory, the people of Kingsbridge, and the wool traders like Elena will profit greatly. That's awesome. We got what we needed. Perfect. And we are done with chapter 12, the Great Beast. I gotta tell you, when I first saw that freaking beast, I really thought this was going a different path, this game. But um, I guess it, uh, it's not. <laughs> I, uh, I really like it, I'm really enjoying this, and I'm looking forward to see what the adventure continues, so let's carry on. I don't want to stop here. I'm really curious to see what's gonna happen next. Chapter 13. The Fleece Fair. A few weeks later. In the last two days of the Fleece Fair, we have collected more money than we did during the last three markets combined. Is the Earl of Shiring not opposed to us doing a Fleece Fair of our own? The law protects us. And our lord. He is. Our time of trepidation is finally over. It will never be over. What did you say, Philip? Nothing. The music is too loud. Our prior is right. The display out there is not appropriate for our monastery. The fair will be over soon. And by then, Kingsbridge will be self-sufficient. Hmm. Oh, oh, here's Tom. I guess we're playing with Tom now. All right, we haven't played with them uh, since the very first episode of this series. I'm glad to be able to play with him again. Let's uh, have a chat with Philip then. Let's see what uh, <coughs> what he's up to. Philip. Yes. Ah, you're back. How are things at the quarry? All's in order. We won't have any further problems. So, uh, why did you ask me to come? It's about Jack. He got into a fight with Alfred again. Have you come to a decision yet? About my proposition? Uh, I'm not sure. Yes, I want to take Jack in as a novice. Uh, let's go with this, whatever. Yes. I think it wise you take in Jack as a novice. He wouldn't work on the cathedral, but he could stay in Kingsbridge. Jack can already read and write, and there is much more we can teach him here. What does his mother think? She may never agree to marry me because of this. She believes I'm favoring Alfred. But Alfred is the master craftsman. I've taught him since he was six. Jack is... Only an apprentice. And the two can't go on like this. No, they cannot. I have no choice. I want the best for my children. For all of them. Of course. Let us talk to Jack then. Yes. Okay, Philip offered to help with Jack. We can go on like this. Um, hmm. Alright, let's take that and uh, carry on here. I don't think we need to talk with any of these monks in here. They're uh, not, it doesn't look like uh, we can interact with them. Okay, let's get the heck Tom? out of here. Oh, what's up? Wait for me. Oh, okay, never mind. Yeah, we gotta go Just together. Here. That's correct. Something is ailing you, isn't it? Philip, you told me in Cuthbert once that if you became prior, you would want the novices to be treated well. Unlike how Remigius treated Brother Marcus before he left us. Remember? It was the day little Jonathan came to us. Yes, I remember. He was so little. You achieved what you set out to do, and so much more. If only Cuthbert was still here with us to see this. Milius, we have not had time to talk since I returned. There was time, but you avoided it. I have a bad feeling about all this. 
Why? For once, all is well. I haven't seen my brother Francis in a long time. I am afraid. For him. For all of us. But it's not just that. No? I think I've lost my faith. You? Let us talk later, like we used to. Yes, of course. We will. Are you not coming, Remigius? I have pressing matters to attend to, my prior. All right. And what kind of surprise is it? Well, I think you'll be amazed, both of you. Ooh, now I'm curious. When can we see it? I should be done this afternoon. Come on, Jonathan. Let's have a look at the bear. Yes, please. <laughs> yes, please. Have fun, boys. Any idea what he's up to? I have no idea. Hmm. Father! Jack took tools from the site. I don't know what he did with them, but I know he took them. Well, you two won't get a chance to quarrel in the future. Philip will see to that. But Jack is not the, the only crap one to is wrong with this. Alfred. I think he's uh, jealous of us. I think he's jealous of Jack uh, hooking up with uh, Eliana. Dang it. Okay, let's use Tom to have a chat with the girls here. Martha, have you seen Jack? He went with Jonathan to see the bear fight. With Jonathan? That's dangerous. What is he thinking? Oh. <laughs> I can't allow anything to happen to Jonathan. I'm responsible for him. Now you're responsible. Seriously, Tom? You're being such an idiot. You're the one that left Jonathan on uh, his mother's grave. Oh, um, by the way, I've heard from Richard. Is he all right? The message didn't say, but I assume he's fine. Why's that? He says he needs me to buy him a new horse. <laughs> <laughs> wow, Richard. Look at him go! Mm. Are you sure you want to see this? Of course. What, what a show. What crap is this? Why did the bear and dog fight? It's in their nature. The beast that is more clever and stronger wins. No. Of course the bear is gonna For win. Them, what the crap? There is no winning. That's <laughs> so stupid. Jonathan, come here. You shouldn't have brought him here. It's dangerous. I'm always doing something wrong no matter what I do. If Alfred had brought him here, I, I bet there wouldn't have been a problem. There would have. Maybe it's better if you and Jonathan go. Yes. Come on. Jack. What? I know how you feel. Oh, really? The world is unjust. We are like these poor animals, forced to tear at each other's flesh. It is a game that they force us to play. Who? Tom? No. The kings and empresses, even the bishop, Tom, and all of us are made to live in an unjust world in which we are forced to make unjust decisions again and again. And we don't even know we are playing their game. You have every right to be angry. But there is a way to remove yourself from that cage. Perhaps not for the sake of God, but for the sake of man. What do you mean? I want you to become a monk. Oh my god, told you the freaking bear is gonna win. <laughs> Wait! Don't go wandering off on your own! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, Tom. Come on. Chase him down. 
Have you two seen my son? Oh, Ellen's Ellen. here. He went over to see the bear fight. Aliena? I ha I have come to... To what? What do you want, What's wrong old friend? I've no idea. Aliena, I, I oh have come to God. ask for your hand <laughs> in marriage. <laughs> Are you mad, Alfred Builder? What? <laughs> Why would you think that I... Oh, what the crap was that? What was that? What? What? What happens? Oh. oh my God! Something bad happened. <laughs> um. Apparently, Tom uh, is not aware of what happened here. But um. Anyway, let's carry on. Let's see. Let's help Jonathan out here. Oh, now, now. I'm here. Should have looked out for you. You want us to go all the way up there? Like Alfred and Jack do? Come on. We'll go together. You and me. <laughs> hmm. Interesting. I think we're taking him uh, all the way up <laughs> the church. <laughs> so, this is it then. What the crap? Who are these? Who's that oh man? my god, no, it's William. What the I crap? I am the Earl of Shiring, boy. Stay with me, Jonathan. Now, while my men inspect your market, tell me. Where is your saint? The crypt. Speak up! Tom! The crypt! Oh, you are Tom Builder. Two birds with one stone. Ah! Jonathan! Huh? What the crap? Seriously? Oh my god, William is such an asshole. <laughs> Oh my god. Oh what? He's setting up the town on fire. What? Wow. Repent. Current location? Kingsbridge Cathedral. Whoa, what's happening? Ah, uh, you know what? Dang it, this is uh, the grave where we bury his uh, wife. Hmm. Yeah, let's go at the grave. Sorry, my love. I am so sorry. All is well, my husband. Rest now. Rest. What? They're freaking what burning the cathedral as well. What the crap? Killing everybody, what a bunch of they assholes. Burning, by God. They were on fire. Where are the others? They're going to kill them! Aliena! Millius locked the door. From the outside? Is he still out there? No. Wow. Uh, oh, so we're controlling Philip. Uh, Jack is definitely not gonna stop here Milius because he wants it. to get to Aliena. Milius! I think I can hear him out there. Oh my god. Return our saint, or you will go to hell. No. 
you go. Wow, no, we, everything is going to shit, William man. Hamley. Seriously now? Oh. Haliena is still out there. So is Jonathan. I will be done. Damn it. I know it. Earth as it is in heaven. It's dangerous to be there. I have to find Jonathan. Um, can we go through here? I don't think so. Oh, no! Forgive us, we will die. Yeah, it's locked. The gate is locked as well. As we have forgiven our debtors. Aliena is this way. So are the attackers. If we go this way, they might not see us. <sighs> You're right. Ah. But it's locked. Oh, man. I don't think we can break through. Oh, never mind. We did. Okay. Um. Let's have a chat with the monks here. What did we do wrong? Nothing. Then why is the Lord punishing us? We are doomed. Stay here. You will be safe. Ever since that lightning struck, Kingsbridge has been cursed. We are doomed. Ever since I've come here, Kingsbridge has been doomed. Thy kingdom come. Oh my God. This is so bad. I don't like this. Um, group of people. Let's chat brother with Andrew, Andrew here. Stand, forgive us he needs to friends. keep the people Pray safe. With our brothers, I will make sure nobody leaves. We have I right. must go out there and find Jonathan. And this is beyond your you. power. Only God can you help him now. Deliver us from evil. Uh, Cantor. Come, we must help oh, the man. wounded outside. No, no, I can't go out oh, there. We you? must! Oh, God. Mm. You didn't see what I name. saw. By God, you didn't see it. Thy kingdom come. The Lord is my shepherd. <gasps> All right. Um, yeah, definitely. There, no, none of them is going to help up, so uh, we need to go after Jack. He's the only one we'll, we'll be able to work with here. Oh, where the crap Jack? did you go, though? Jack! Hmm. No! Oh my god. Here. Words from the scripture will calm her. Look at her husband. Look at her. Wait, Your what? words won't do any good. I won't allow you to poison her, woman. What the crap? Come on. This hurt um... will help her. It works. Oh. I will not let you use your devil's work on her. I tried to move her, but she doesn't want to let go. We need to get her out of harm's way. I know that, Prior. We need to help her calm down somehow. Uh, maybe we need to use those herbs. Let's What's see. going on here? Look at that poor woman. Her husband has died in her arms. Your sub-Prior refuses to let me help her. Her herbage is the devil's work. Shut the heck up, Remigius. We must Remigius. get away from here. William and his men will ride this way. I know it. You're right. We must make haste. Philip, I told you this woman is a witch. You're a fool. This is Henbane. Henbane? The devil's eye. So you admit that you are trying to poison this woman. Oh, does the evil eye of the flower intimidate you, you old goat? Calm down, all of you! Prior Philip, take this. It will hmm. calm her nerves if she chews on it. For once, do the right thing. Uh, Ellen progresses. 
Ellen proposes we use this herb to call Mary. Uh, we're definitely gonna have to use this. James was right about you. Yeah, let's Prior do it, let's do it. James. You have no idea what kind of man Prior James was. You are a fool. Are you sure this won't harm her? Yes, I am. Yeah, no. do we already? We grow herbs too, Remigius. <laughs> Shut up, Remigius. Go ahead. I'm holding her. Is this gonna work? It's working. I told you. Maybe I was wrong about you, Philip. How could you do that? <laughs> oh, piss on you. They're coming. <laughs> we oh, need crap, to move they're coming. Now. Yeah, get the heck out of here. It makes no sense. Why would the Earl of Shire do this? Shut up. Or they will kill us all. It's them. Shh. Oh my god. Freaking William, man. He did quite well. He got pretty far. There was someone here with him. Hugh is right. They might be close by. Oh my god, seriously? We should make haste. We got what we came for. Not yet. Wow. Water, why do I get the feeling you're upset? We didn't have to do this. We came for the saint. They deserved it. Like this ugly bastard. Kingsbridge defied us for the last time. That monk, the bitch, and the bastard she's fucking. <sighs> oh. Oh, crap. I think that's Jack. Oh, Come yeah. On, move. After him. But William said... I said move. Oh, thank God. He got him to move, though. He saved us. My little cub! Are you alright? Did you see Aliena? She was in the market. I heard William calling out her name. Jack, come! We must find her and Jonathan. Hmm. Damn. It's all gone bad here. I, oh my god, look at this. All our freaking work. Damn it. Freaking William, man. He's gonna pay for this. Oh my god. Dear God. Oh. Oh. No. Aliena. Aliena! Jonathan! What? She was back there. She looked okay. Oh yeah, she's okay. He took everything from me again. Aliena! No matter what you do, no matter where you go, I will find you. Every time you think you are safe, every time you play house, I will find you. And I will crush you. Now, kill them all and make her watch. Aliena, are you all right? I swear by Almighty God and Jesus Christ and all the saints that I will take care of my brother Richard until he has fulfilled his vow. Can't you hear me? Jack! Okay, now. It's all gone. I can't support Richard like this. What am I going to do now? Wow. Oh my god. Uh, please tell me Jonathan is not dead here. Tom. Oh, oh no, no, they're alright. <sighs> no. What? Please tell me John is not dead. Tom is not dead. What the crap? 
the next day. Oh my god, seriously? We must ask the bishop for help. The bishop? Are you mad? I heard he is behind this. Shh! How? How can we go on living in Kingsbridge now? Will the cathedral still be built? Not without the market. It, it, it must be, or there'll be no work for us. Please. Our prior will answer all of your questions. Huh. Philip, they are waiting for you. <sighs> yes. Can we stay in Kingsbridge? Talk about the attack, inspire confidence, talk about the saint, comrade, the dead and the injured. Commemorate the dead and injured. <coughs> Let's go with that. <laughs> Too many people have died. Many were injured. Among the dead. Oh my is god, Tom, Tom is dead. What the crap? He died protecting our little Jonathan. For which I will be eternally grateful. Tom Builder is dead. What will happen to our cathedral now? Two of our brothers have perished. Wow. Brother Arnaldus. And brother Milius. He rests by Cuthbert's side now. And eight more lives were taken. Will the Earl of Shireen be judged for what he did? He must be! Yes, he must! What about the saint? Where is the saint? Adolphus will protect us. It would be better if you answer their questions. Shut up, Remigius! Holy crap! Please tell us what to do! Uh, talk about the saint, talk about the attack, inspire confidence. Let's talk about the saint, I guess. <clears throat> Sam Remigius. The rumors you have heard are true. The remains of Saint Adolphus were stolen from this crypt. Oh! We are doomed. The saint's gone. Who took him? Was it the Earl of Shiring? Why would he do that? Milius died to protect the saint. I saw it. Is he not well? He looks pale. Um, inspired confidence. Brother Andrew is overseeing the repairs. And we will be able to continue the construction of our cathedral. Tom Builder's son, Alfred will take over the position of Master Builder. Though it will take longer, for we will not hold a market again. And I am happy to welcome a new novice. Most of us are familiar with him, so I'm sure we all can share the sentiment that he will be very welcome in our Priory. Jack. As was Tom's wish. Why were we attacked? Was that really the Earl of Shiring? He will answer your questions. All of them. Please tell us! Oh, uh, and finally, let's talk about the attack, I guess. This attack... With Kingsbridge. Shall I continue for you, my prior? No. This attack 
was a great tragedy. I cannot think of why anyone would do that to us. It is impossible to grasp how these men could just... You went against the Earl of Shiring! He said you defied him! Philip was in the right. We had a market license. Our prior was in the right, but we all knew what kind of man William Hamley is. Defiance will only lead to more grief. I... I agree. You should be more careful. We must never again hold a market. No. No, we must not. The Earl stole the site because of Philip. But it's not his fault, is it? They all had to die for the market. Why is he not answering? Please answer! Mm. I guess we need to inspire confidence again. Oh my god, this is so freaking sad. Why is he not saying anything? How will we go on? Why is God doing this to us? Answer they have so many him. unanswered questions. Uh, finally, inspire confidence. No. I cannot give you confidence. Oh, the story reminds... of how God tested the faith of his followers. I see now how true they are. I think you do as well. I am asking myself where is God? Why did he not prevent all this? I do not know. I have no answer. Oh. One day, God said to Satan, Look at my man Job. There's a good man if ever I saw one. So Satan said, You've given him everything. That's why he's a good man. But God said, Even if he were to lose everything he has, his faith in me would not falter, and I will prove it to you. You will burn in hell for this. What? I defeated your greatest enemy. It was a holy mission. It's not up to you to decide that. Even your father would not have been that foolish. I am not my father. They saw you. They know that the Earl of Shiring is a murderer. What if my allies in Kingsbridge were hurt? What then? Absolve my sins. <laughs> Only if you announce your loyalty to King Stephen. No! Stephen lost. He is weak. Bishop Henry will not approve of me giving absolution to a supporter of Empress Maud. Are you a man of the church or not? I am. Then do as you are told. And never defy me again. Is that understood? Yes, my bishop. Wow, um, oh my god, I gotta say, I was not expecting this. Chapter 13, The Fleece Fair, has been such a horrible episode. Um, yeah, this is really sad. Unfortunately, we lost Tom. I hope uh, his son and Jack are gonna be able to finalize the construction of the cathedral. Man! This was this was really bad. Anyway, uh, this is our time for now. I hope you guys did enjoy the episode. I gotta say, I enjoyed it, even though it is quite sad what's happening here. But, um, man, I hate William. <laughs> I can't wait and really hope that we will get a chance to take him out. Because he is an evil, evil man. Alright, thank you guys for watching the video so far. If you enjoyed it, do not forget to leave a like down below. Subscribe if you're not subscribed. And... I'll see you all in the next episode. Bye!